Back at the hut, Herodula has outgrown his armor and left it hanging on a branch. After shedding his shell, Herodula is tired and vulnerable. He must stay very still. The tables have turned. The hunter is now the hunted. A lucky escape for Herodula, but not so for the cricket. Papilio is beginning her extraordinary transformation. She spun a single silken thread, which suspends her from a stem. Within hours, her caterpillar coat will split and peel away. Beneath, she is sheltered inside a hard case. Disguised as a leaf, she is safe from hungry eyes. The forest is full of such deceptions. A thorn bug is a thorn until its neighbor moves. In this forest, dead leaves walk. The trilobite beetle's armor blends with the bark. bother with a ball of fluff. It's a ladybird larva in disguise. Here's another defense. Make a noise. All look big and mean. Though, show off too much, and the plan backfires. To stay out of trouble, it's best not to stick out. Papilio is also still hidden, camouflaged as a leaf. Inside, an astonishing transformation has begun. Two weeks have passed. It's the dawn of a new day.
For Papilio, it's a new beginning. In the miracle of metamorphosis, her caterpillar form has been liquefied into a milky soup and reassembled as a butterfly. Papilio's adult life lasts a mere few weeks. Her new wings slowly fill with blood. Her shimmering scales catch the warm sun. Only now can she discover the freedom of flight. a flat-footed caterpillar. Papilio has been quick to find a mate. Reproduction is what bugs do best. It's one of the reasons they dominate the planet. There are at least a billion, billion insects on Earth. Just one square mile can hold as many insects as there are people on this planet. But where there are bugs, bug hunters will follow. This colony of three million bats will devour more than two and a half tons of insects every night. 